Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title of this video, this is going to be a get ready with me for a job interview. The really great thing about this though is that I lost the beginning of this video. I had a whole intro and explanation filmed of what this job interview is for and why I'm going to it and just like all this other stuff why I quit my other job and I accidentally deleted it when I was trying to clear up some space on my camera. So. <laughs> It starts at a very weird place and it doesn't really make sense. I kind of talk about a bunch of stuff and then um, towards the end of the video is when I actually start talking about the interview because again it got chopped off so I had to like re-talk about it when I was doing my hair. I'm really really sorry about that. So this video is kind of a mess. I think that's everything I have to say. So I hope you enjoy and uh, let's get right into it. watched said that you should present yourself like very natural like kind of like an I woke up like this kind of thing so not to wear a ton of makeup or do any like crazy eye looks or like anything like that which I'm really glad that they said that because I would have thought that they would want to see some like cool makeup stuff which I don't know why it's like a clothing store but like I don't know I was prepared to beat my face and like I still kind of am but I'm gonna make it very natural so like yeah I'm wearing foundation but that's just because like I have really uneven skin I have been doing like really 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 natural makeup for the summer with no foundation at all and I'm planning on doing a video about that that'll probably be another Wednesday video you know when you're going into a job interview you want to look like you already have the job you want to look like an employee I really don't remember what I was saying Oh yeah, I was just saying like you watching videos and like preparing for an interview. I think that's a great way to prepare for an interview. Like YouTube is such a good like resource because so many people share their experiences. I mean, there was a million videos about interviewing at Hollister and I really only watched a couple. The only thing that's like kind of making me nervous about this interview is a lot of people said that they um, had group interviews at Hollister and I don't know if that's how it's gonna be. I've never done a group interview and that kind of makes me nervous like having to answer questions in front of other people as well as like the manager because like answering questions to the manager is like easy that's not an issue but answering questions in front of other people that you're like competing with I don't know a group interview has just always kind of sounded like an awful thing to me so I guess we'll see it's not a huge deal if I don't get the job because I have a job YouTube is my job but I still want to like do well you know something else that I did want to talk to you guys about though and that I want you guys to like get excited for is that I am doing my very first collaborative video and I'm very 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 excited about it. I'm doing it with a, another YouTuber named Juliet Nichman. Her channel is awesome. She does a lot of like wellness and lifestyle stuff. I will have her channel linked down below so you guys can go and kind of get to know her a little bit first and everything before we do our collab and I'll also have her Instagram in the description as well. Yeah, she does a lot of like lifestyle and like healthy eating and like food videos and stuff like that. And she's just really awesome. And I actually reached out to her on Instagram and you know, I told her that I really loved her channel and that I loved, you know, her Instagram and everything too. And that we should do a collab together because, oh, I just got powder all over my pants. <gasps> Mm. Anyway, um, <laughs> I told her that if she ever wanted to talk, you know, or just like chat or whatever and maybe possibly do a collab together, that that would be awesome and that I'd be so interested in doing that. And she ended up responding. We ended up talking a ton and kind of just getting to know each other and whatever and planning a collab video, which I'm so excited about. If you're not following me on Instagram, you need to definitely go follow me because I include you guys in stuff like this. So we are doing a girl talk video. Part one will be on one of our channels and then part two will be on the other. And we wanna get questions from you guys 
directly. So we both posted slash are gonna continue to post a little question box on Instagram so that we can get questions from you guys to answer in that video. And it can literally be about anything like periods, boyfriends, you know, dating, and just literally anything that you might have questions about and want us to talk about. So definitely go follow both of us, not just me. Follow both of us and send us your questions. You can DM them to us if you don't see the post on our stories. You can comment them on our videos. It's literally whatever you want to do. So yeah, I'm really, really excited about that. Julia is awesome. She is just like a great person and we are both obviously smaller YouTubers and I think this is just going to be a really good opportunity for both of us. I hope that you guys love Julia as much as I do. My last video this past Wednesday was a room tour video, which I honestly really think that it turned out pretty good. That was kind of the follow-up video to my room makeover video, which I just recently did to I think like two weeks ago. You can't really see it behind me right now, but I love the way that my room turned out. I'm obsessed with it. And you guys should really go check it out because especially my room makeover video, I put my heart, soul, time, energy, money, like so much into that video and into this room. It would honestly just mean so much to me if you guys went and watched it and checked it out and left a comment and let me know how you like it. <sighs> Excuse me. Um, is that what you say after you sneeze? Excuse me? Or is that just... Now I'm confused. I know people usually say bless you and there's no one here to say that to me, but do people ever say excuse me? I don't know, that sounded weird when I said it. Anyways, and now I forget what I was saying again. Oh, yeah, I was talking about my room makeover. Anyways, so... That video really just means a ton to me and it would mean a lot if you guys went. My camera cut me off, sorry about that. Um, I don't know exactly where it cut me off though, so. We're just gonna move on from that topic. Um, oh, I know what else we can talk to you guys about. So, my brother just recently started a YouTube channel and when I say my brother started a YouTube channel, I really mean that I started a YouTube channel for my brother. Um, <laughs> so my brother is really into um, like weightlifting and bodybuilding and working out and eating healthy and like all of that kind of stuff. So he wanted me to do a video for him of him and his buddies. One of his friends actually started a business, like a clothing line of like workout stuff called No Handouts. My brother is kind of on their like rep team. He wanted me to do kind of like a promotional video of the team and everything for his YouTube channel that he just created. So I went to the gym with him and his buddies one day and I recorded them all like deadlifting and working out and all of that kind of stuff. And then I edited it and uploaded it to his YouTube channel. So it is up there I'm going to link his channel down below as well and also follow him on Instagram and follow the no handouts Instagram as well um, their apparel is pretty cool if you like to work out I don't so not really for me but um, <laughs> if you do like to work out they have leggings they have they have a lot of stuff I'm gonna I'll put a little like screenshot of all of their um, products right here because I don't 100% know everything that they sell but it's pretty cool. Um, so you guys should go check out that video. It was the first time that I've ever done anything like that before. I'm gonna go ahead and put on my mascara off camera really quick. Oh, I got mascara in my eye. Why does one set of eyelashes always look better than the other? Like, this set just looks all wonky and this set looks like really pretty. So we actually just hit 3,000 subscribers here on YouTube and I just want to say thank you guys so much. I really have only been posting on this channel for like maybe three months and the growth that I've seen in the past three months is just honestly insane to me. Like 3,000 subscribers in three months is crazy. Like you guys are awesome. I love you all so much. You guys, my camera just ran out of storage. And I went to delete some stuff. And I deleted the beginning of this video. I have no idea what footage I lost. Like how much of me like talking and getting ready that I lost. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I still have to do my hair. 
So I'm gonna go back and watch and see what footage I lost and like of me talking, how much of it is gone now, and then maybe I'll just like re-talk about it while I'm doing my hair. Okay, so I am sitting down in front of my big mirror now, which is where I do my hair. Well, I went downstairs and had some food because I haven't eaten all day and it's 2.30. And now I have to re-talk about everything that I talked about in the beginning of the video and also do a new intro. I've just recently started curling my hair a lot more than I ever used to because I never used to be good at it. So the way that I curl my hair is I part my hair down the middle, which I know I look freaking crazy, but I just think it looks better when I part it down the middle, curl both sides, and then repart it on this side because it makes it look a little less like, it makes the curls look a little less like purposefully placed and more just kind of like, I just woke up like this. This is the curling one that I use. It is the Best Ope uh, curling one with deta the detachable heads. I have like, five or six attachments that like came with it. This is my favorite one, it's the thickest one and it's the same thickness all the way around. I like big curls, I don't like little loose like bouncy curls. So this is my favorite one. I'll leave a link to this in the description. It's just from Amazon and it's really, really good. Honestly, I love this. So I don't know where the video cut off exactly like what I was speaking about, but I do know that I lost me talking about like what exactly I'm getting ready for. Obviously the title, it's an interview. So if you have been watching my channel for a while, you know probably that I used to work at Chick-fil-A and I just recently quit there maybe a little over a month ago-ish. Wasn't really planned. When I initially quit, I, I put in a couple applications. I tried to apply at Starbucks, but they weren't hiring. And then I put in an application at Hollister at the mall near me and then at this place called Dry Goods at the mall near me. And they're both just clothing stores because I really didn't want to work in food again. I like never really like followed up or like was, I wasn't really like trying to get a job really because I am getting paid on YouTube. My paycheck on YouTube actually just recently started equating to what my paychecks from Chick-fil-A were. And so I was like, I really could just make YouTube basically my full-time job until I get into my career field. That was basically my plan was to not get a job and to just be working with YouTube and making that my main focus and whatnot. And then like a week ago, I got a call from Hollister and they asked me to come in for an interview. And I was like, you know what, why not? Because we'll just go, we'll go to the interview, we'll see what happens, we'll see what it's like. And then I'll just, you know, if they offer me a job, I'll decide if I wanna take it. And if they don't offer me a job, then fine, it's not a big deal. Like, I really, I don't need a job right now. I still have money coming in. My interview is today, obviously. It's at four and it's currently like 2.40. Yeah, I'm like not really putting any pressure on this interview at all. It's not a big deal to me if I get the job or not. I'm just going to speed this up a bit because I am struggling to talk and do this at the same time. You want to say hi? <laughs> hey, say hi, Gavin. curls cool I like to flip my hair over and like run my fingers through them so I'm gonna do that then I just repart it on the side where I normally have it so I also wanted to show you guys the outfit that I am gonna be wearing normally if I was going to an interview I'd probably wear like business casual or something like that but because this is a retail and like it's Hollister like I'm not gonna wear business clothes because that's not what you would wear as an employee so I am wearing this two-piece set this is the skirt and this is the top it's like really really cute oh, that's the back this is the front and um, I actually got this from Hollister and I think I'm gonna wear my gray Vans with it because I think that's what will match the best. So I'm gonna get dressed and then I'll show you guys like 
the whole finished look. So this is the outfit. Ignore my messy bed, I didn't make it today. I figured I should probably wear something from Hollister considering it's an interview at Hollister, but I don't know, I guess we'll see how that goes. And it is currently 3.05, so I'm gonna get ready to leave here in about a half hour because I live like 20-ish minutes from the mall and I wanna make sure that I get there with plenty of time to like get to the actual store and like I want to be like kind of early so that is pretty much everything for this video again I'm really really sorry about the fact that like it was kind of a mess because I lost the footage at the beginning but regardless I hope that you guys enjoyed and if you did make sure to give this video a thumbs up it really helps me out since I'm a smaller youtuber and make sure that you subscribe down below if you have not already we are on our way to 5,000 subscribers that's our current goal and at this very moment we have 3060 so that's awesome we are less than 2k away from hitting that goal also make sure to follow me on Instagram if you're not already again like I've said a million times throughout this video I keep you guys really updated over there and involved in my videos and stuff like that so definitely make sure to check me out um, there. Make sure to check all of the links in the description as well to my brother's channel and his Instagram and Julia's channel and her Instagram and be on the lookout for our collab coming out very, very soon. And I think that is everything that I have for you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. <laughs> Bye.